Understanding the phrase, gathering for Eid, in English. Hello everyone, welcome to our English learning channel. Today, we're going to explore a special phrase, gathering for Eid. This phrase is not just about words. It's about culture, celebration, and community. So, let's dive in and understand what this phrase really means and how it's used in English. Gathering for Eid refers to the social and communal activities associated with the Islamic holiday known as Eid. There are two primary Eids celebrated by Muslims, Eid al-Fitr and Eid al-Adha. Eid al-Fitr is celebrated at the end of Ramadan, a month of fasting, while Eid al-Adha is known as the Feast of Sacrifice, coinciding with the Hajj pilgrimage. The word, gathering, in this context signifies coming together of families, friends, and communities to celebrate, feast, and perform communal prayers. Eid gatherings are a vibrant example of Islamic culture and traditions. These gatherings are characterized by specific rituals, like wearing new clothes, preparing special dishes, giving charity, known as zakat, and exchanging gifts. For many Muslims, Eid gatherings are a time for reconciliation, joy, and strengthening community bonds. By understanding this, learners of English can appreciate the cultural depth behind the phrase. To fully grasp gathering for Eid, let's see it in action. Here are some example sentences. 1. Our family is hosting a large gathering for Eid this year. 2. I'm looking forward to the community's gathering for Eid. It's always a joyful event. 3. The gathering for Eid will include special prayers at the mosque. Notice how the phrase can be used to describe both private family events and larger community celebrations. I hope this video has given you a deeper understanding of the phrase, gathering for Eid, and its significance in the Islamic culture. Eid celebrations are a beautiful example of how language intertwines with culture and community. Thank you for watching, and we hope this lesson has been both informative and enjoyable. Stay tuned for more insights into English language and culture.